Conestoga high quality pre-machined cabinet components are valued by professional cabinet makers for their expert engineering and craftsmanship. Conestoga cabinet systems give customers more product options and save time and money. We're going to show you how to build our cabinets using simple tools and basic assembly techniques. Cabinet sides, tops, and bottoms all come with pre-inserted splines used to hold parts together until glue dries. On front frame styles, the side is recessed in the spline groove. On front frame rails, the top and bottom butt against the rails. Glue must be applied to unfinished surfaces any place two parts are joined. Front frame styles and rails, female dovetails, the back rabbits of sides, and in grooves of backs. After you've finished assembling a cabinet, use a damp cloth to wipe away any excess glue. Pins or staples are used to fasten the back to the sides, top, and bottom. If a side will be unexposed in the finished kitchen, pin through the sides into the back. If sides are exposed or flush, toenail the back to sides. Have these basics on hand, woodworking glue, rubber mallet, and a pin or staple gun with one inch pins or staples. Start with the front frame face down on a flat, clean surface. Apply a bead of glue to both sides of the spline groove in the styles of the front frame. Now insert the sides and tap them down to make sure they're securely in place. Apply a bead of glue to both sides of the spline groove in the rails of the front frame and one-third of the way down in the female dovetails of the sides. The rabbit should be facing towards the inside of the cabinet, and the splines should be facing down. Now slide the bottom into the dovetails. Repeat this procedure for the top piece. Apply a bead of glue to the inside rabbet of the sides and to the tenon on the top and bottom. Insert the back between the rabbets in the sides, making sure the groove in the back aligns with and captures the tenons on the top and bottom. Pin or staple the back to the top and bottom using the scribe line to place the fasteners. Pins or staples should be spaced a minimum of three inches apart. Finally, fasten the sides to the back. Remember to wipe away any extra glue and the job is complete. If you have assembly questions or need more information on Conestoga's cabinet systems, please refer to the contact information shown on this screen.